All right. So we're here at um, the 2017 World Rally Championship in Coffs Harbour and um, we've got Rui here and he's going to give us a bit of a rundown on um, this new i20 rally car. So this is our uh, 2017 uh, WRC car. Obviously the regulation changed from last year to this one. The cars are wider, you've got a bigger aero package and um, that's most of it. Okay, obviously also the engine is more powerful now due to a bigger restrictor. It's 1.6 liter turbo. And a direct injection. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. And what sort of power do they put out? About 380, okay. thereabouts. Do you know how many pound of boost these things run? Well, actually we run about 2 to 2.5 bar of boost. Wow. But uh, it's all controlled by FIA, so uh -huh. there are rallies where we don't Your have restrictors that restrictors and all that sort of yeah, stuff. Yeah, exactly. Cool, cool, cool. So basically the car, it's uh, pretty much all made bespoke for rallying. So everything is quite strong. The dampers have been longer so that you can uh, cope with the rough stages and with the gravel. Yeah. You have the brakes, which are slightly smaller than a tarmac car, but still far bigger than you would have on a road car. Four pot pistons, so you've got a lot of braking power force and then all the cooling to refrigerate because obviously everything gets quite warm. Yeah. So uh, then obviously the most interesting bit is under the bonnet, yeah. that I cannot show you honestly. <laughs> but and then you have the cockpit which is where the drivers spend all, all their day. So obviously for the driver we have gear shift on a paddle shift yeah. and then if this fails, so that means we've either lost the hydraulics or have some problem, we still have the old system. So pull forwards if you want to reduce gears, pull uh -huh. backwards if you want to okay. put gears. Then you have yeah. our uh, hydraulic handbrake. Yeah. Uh, obviously the steering wheel, it's um, you've got all the buttons on the steering wheel so that it's within range for the driver. We have our center differential controls here on the top. We have our lights and anti lag on the bottom. Permanent all-wheel drive uh -huh. with obviously a repetition front to rear. The, the pedals, so uh, every, there is a floor mounted pedal box so that we can try to put all the weight down and reduce the center of gravity. Yeah. And um, it has got separated massive cylinders for front to the rear so we can change, change, the, bias. The, exactly, yeah. change the bias according to the driver needs. Yeah. The seats are also bespoke for our drivers, so all of them have got their own padding, so it suits them like a glove. The, all the air that comes into the car comes through here. Uh -huh. Then obviously we have two pressure releases on the back of the car, but the whole car is quite hermetically sealed. So okay. uh, in the workshop we do put a smoke machine just to make sure there is no dust going in. Yeah, because I mean, like I, I got completely covered in dust. And yes. I was, yes. I just no, surprised how clean everything it, it inside is. It is a bad sign if the driver starts to get some <laughs> dust inside. <laughs> Cool, cool. I'm sorry, Bob. I didn't need that. No worries. Thank you very okay. much for that. Have a very, You're very welcome. great day. And uh, good luck.